what is Africa going to become? Man, Africa would have become <laughs> a no-go area. Have you seen any Ghanaian that talk about Nigerians? It's true. No Ghanaian do that. Because you know why? When a Ghanaian YouTuber sits down and make downgrading those of Nigerians, his country men and women, they, they'll flood his comment section and insult the living daylight and cause that person depression. They do not support bad behavior against other African countries. But you, especially Nigerians from a particular region, when you, hater of peace, hater of oneness, sit down and make your condescending videos, condescending remarks about other African countries, they will flood your timeline, especially when you're talking about Ghana. Are you people not tired? Leave Nigerian YouTubers alone. Advise these Nigerians that are making these type of videos. Um, you said you must support your own no matter what. No, I will never marry a cyber criminal because I can't support him. I will never associate myself with people that are not credible because I'm not going to defend you because, because you are my person. I am married to you. I kidnap her. I will protect you. I will keep silence. I will do, yeah, the likes of Evans. You know, whose wife was busy enjoying the money while her, while her husband was causing other Nigerians pain. Sending people broke uh, in, into depression and making others to take their lives. The wife did not complain. Well, I don't want to be that wife. God forbid. I will never support bad things. If you are new here, hi. My name is Lillian and this is a reaction video. If you have not subscribed to my channel, kindly go on ahead and hit the subscription button. Do not just subscribe, but turn on the bell notification so that anytime I upload a video, YouTube will notify you. I mean, where is this video coming from? Of course, it's coming from one and only God bless Nigeria by a Nigerian from a particular region that hates the word oneness, togetherness, cohibition, respect for others. They don't know this word and she has a message for Nigerian YouTubers. You know, I went to watch the video carefully to see if at any point the mama born away to call me to talk about me. Like, but I didn't see that and because of this. You are the one that called your country a zoo. There is a YouTuber who is always making a video of negative things in Nigeria. And he claimed to be a Nigerian. As far as I'm concerned, you are not. You can see she's referring to a man. And who is this Nigerian YouTuber in Ghana that this woman is talking about? But anyways, let me go to Pleasant Green and play a clip from his latest video and see the Nigerian that this woman is supposed to talk to and not a Nigerian YouTuber in Ghana that is reacting to videos of other people that is already out on the internet. I'll be back. Um, I got all the I got all these people texting me. I'm sorry about that. Actually, um, I won't lie to you. I don't know people texting you actually. What? But this is what you go do. This is what you go do. Are you hearing me? Uh, no. Who are these I, people? Who are these people texting me? Is it you? I don't understand. I don't know the people texting you actually. I don't know them. Those people are scam. They're fraudulent. What the heck? They're scam. How'd they get my yeah, number? No, I don't. Did you give them my I number? I don't give anyone your number. Okay, so I need to get to the bottom of this. So I create a text group with Roberts 1, 2, and 3 so we can sort it all out. Then he calls. Why would you believe me? I'll be talking to you for this. How did they get my number? I gave them your number yesterday. It's true. This morning. Why did you what? Why did you give someone else my number? It's because they were asking that they want to make payments to your number yesterday instead of the email. That's why I was asking. But why are you talking to scammers? Why did you give my number to other scammers? I did not know that they were scammers. I did not know. You know, if people, some people want to do as if they want to buy your products, they'll tell you, okay. And we have Nigerian scammers scamming other Nigerian scammers. And back in the group, Robert One says, these guys are not real. But Robert Two says, who's that? Ogun Wan kill you, Nai. Go and block him now, WTF. Time to tell Robert that his game is over. Hey, Mr. Robert. Yeah. Hey, you know that email? You know that email that I sent you? You know that email that I sent you that uh, where I shared my ID with you? Yes, I have the email. Yeah, when you clicked on that, I traced your IP address, and uh, it shows that you're in Nigeria right now. 
I'm not. I've got your IP address right here. These are the Nigerians you, Madam English uh, lecturer, is supposed to address and not innocent young Nigerians that are reacting to videos that are already on the internet made by your people. Nigerians from your region made these videos and use their hand to upload it on the internet. Your people, Nigerians, your brothers and sisters, because money must be made. Anyhow that money will be made must be made. These are the Nigerians you're supposed to talk to. The one that, the, those ones, Yahoo boys, the ones that are scamming people that gives you a bad image. Those are the Nigerians you're supposed to advise. And another set of Nigerians I strongly believe should, in fact, if you must talk, if you, an instigator of fights social media brouhaha all the time because if you think you have the, the moral standard to talk about what people should do you i mean you of all people that make inciting videos of you know telling nigerians to stop playing ghanaian music you're always up to like you hate it so much when you see ghanaians and nigerians moving on without problem you will sit down at your some corner with those your low lights these are the nigerians you're supposed to address and not nigerian youtubers in ghana who the hell are you to think you can leave all these your people to come and address a nigerian youtuber in ghana whether he or she i don't care any nigerian youtuber in ghana that must be addressed are the ones that are always looking for trouble the ones that are always making up things that are not true just because of course they are your sisters they are your brothers and you know now you guys must always find a reason to complain on to complain about other people you always want to feel like you're better than the rest because of course back home in your region there are states that are believed to be better than some uh -huh. then from the region you move to other regions where you believe your region is better than theirs there's always there there have always been issues everywhere is nothing if you sit down you guys are amazing but if you sit down and think about it maybe it's just your condescending attitude like just like what you're doing now you sit wherever you are under some nonsense lights and then you send a message to nigerian youtubers in ghana like what are you feeling like okay those ants that are gathering around your comment section all the time making you feel like you are a celebrity because uh, yeah the way you speak your english they think maybe you know <laughs> they think you know so much madam focus on what is important if you, you must advise nigerians i think that the nigerians you should advise these ones that make videos like this imagine a nigerian youtuber that have never been to ghana before went on to get a video of the university of ghana and compare it and compare it to a university at a countryside in nigeria and now that video is coming oh then later you people will sit down and look for find fault in other people because we live in ghana you will find fault you were in ghana so why did you leave ghana and become so obsessed and you start to yeah just full of why are you like this madam what is your problem you made a video on Cameroon. You praised them to the high mountain Kilimanjaro, back to mountain Everest, and you came back to the seas of the river Niger. You went on to praise them to the sunset of Bini. The video no do well. You delete them because Cameroonians they don't send you. Because Nigerians will never support you because you did not insult Ghanaians in the video. And the reason Nigerians didn't watch that video is because already you can tell the relationship between Ghanaians and Nigeria is more solid than the relationship between Cameroon and Nigerians. Because of course, Cameroon will give it to you guys. You do anyhow, you collect. Because like you describe them, they are just like you, a replicant of your grandmother. So, of course, you know what that means. When someone is like you, what do you get in return from that person? Woto, woto. If you are a giver of woto, just like you always give. Why do you always act like you are a peacemaker when you are the problem? Leave Ghana alone. Address these Nigerian YouTubers in Nigeria that are making this style of content. How can you compare a university? And all these people are from your place. Stop feeling like you're very important. You are not. Stop Stop sitting down at wherever you are, whether you maybe you're in Ghana or wherever you 
after collaborating with a journalist to write about young people that are young enough to be your children it's not enough you see when you came and sat down and sent a letter to nigerian youtubers in ghana by the time i went through all the video i knew there was no part of the video that has me in it because i don't call my country zoo is always your people that do this is your people that call nigeria zoo so i felt like if at all you want to address these are the nigerians you should address not nigerian youtubers in ghana because they have not been any there is no nigerian youtuber in ghana that calls nigeria zoo is always nigerians in nigeria so why do you think it's all right for you to jump to ghana or do you want me to play clips upon clips why are you people always looking for problem leave nigerian youtubers in ghana alone okay your channel already nigerians have showed you that if you don't sit down and insult Ghanaians, they won't watch your video and that is why you constantly do that from time to time when you see say everywhere want to calm down you will just look look out hey what did they happen there hey, let me come and cause trouble and run back so they will not know i'm the one some of us are very intelligent and i know you i know your type madam leave nigerian youtubers in ghana alone and mind your own business i am tired of talking and nigerians are supposed to address the scammers the one that are disgracing you see someone talking about something and someone that is doing that thing are not the same the reason i'm talking about something for instance is because you have given me a reason to talk about it what about not doing that thing at all you say a few nigerian a few a few backs act a few backs act i mean imagine the other countries have a few bad acts put together what is africa going to become man africa would have become <laughs> a no-go area since you're always the yastic is always the yastic for bad behavior for you you make up excuses is it that see pray hard so that all these things you're defending will not happen to you pray hard so you don't get scammed pray hard so that all the vices that are happening in the country that makes you still see that pretend because you don't want other people to laugh at us that's against us yeah of course i know there are some Ghanaians that enjoys your content they come to your comment section and tell you have you seen any Ghanaian that talk about nigerians it's true Ghanaians do not do that because you know why when a Ghanaian youtuber sits down and make condescending videos of nigerians his country men and women will flood his timeline they, they will flood his comment section and insult the living daylight and cause that person depression they do not support bad behavior against other african countries but you especially nigerians from your region sit down and make your condescending remarks about other african countries they will flood your timeline especially when you're talking about ghana are you people not tired leave nigerian youtubers alone advise these nigerians that are making these type of videos i mean like a nigerian from your village <laughs> So you see the reason why Ghana people, Cameroon, and uh, many other countries are always calling Nigeria Generator Republic. It's or Ghana conductor carrying your luggage and run away. If you have met something like that, if you have experienced it, drop in the comment. Let's know in the comment section. But in Nigeria here is not like that too. If you give them your luggage. They will carry your luggage and run away. Religion in a country that has decayed. Nigeria has decayed, decayed. When something has decayed, where do you want to patch? If care is not taken, maybe it's from your state, your family member, who knows, is making a video of this nature and you're looking at it, you're not saying anything, you, you're blind, you can't see. Nigerians are calling Nigeria zoo are not in Ghana. They are back home. They are the ones at your comment section. Those haters. Those millipedes. Why are you people always like this? You see as you continue to keep these videos coming. <laughs> I am here to keep mine coming. And I hope 
that you can sustain it because if you want you want to go to court <laughs> really is equal to the tax because enough is enough for you to have used a, a, a newspaper like vanguard you try to silence people and you see that they are still doing their thing simply means that you are nothing you don't mean anything to the people so zukwanike oh losimi zukwanike madam rest in jesus name please why are you people like this now let you sit down for ghana why are you people like this you said you must support your own no matter what no i will never marry a cyber criminal because i can't support him i will never associate myself with people that are not credible because i'm not going to defend you because because you are my person i am married to you i kidnapper i'll protect you i'll keep silence i will do yeah the likes of advance you know whose wife was busy enjoying the money while her husband is into all sort of causing other nigerians while her husband was causing other nigerians pain kidnapping and destroying families sending people into broke uh, in, into depression and making others to take their lives the wife did not complain well i don't want to be that wife god forbid i will never support bad thing if you think that you can come and sit down and insult Ghanaians or insult other african countries and then i will collaborate with you to make me a patriotic nigerian Nto, madam you are a loser I like you nothing for you so you have to plan harder and better because that is not going to work. Yeah, trust me. Whether it's about the views or not, I will never do that to other people because, I mean, why? If I have any complaint to make, if my kids do something that is wrong, I will now say, okay, because Nami born you now, let me go and beat other people's children for you. Even when I know that my child is at fault and this same child will grow up to go out there and cause your passport to be because of why what you just said in that video support your people anyhow it is just support them why are you people stop doing videos about ghana if you can't keep it positive fuck off yes what is this if other other people from your region are always at your comment section crying blood because that is the only place they can console themselves i don't care about you so why should nigerian youtubers in ghana care about you who are you like i don't care for me here whether you are the president's wife you know they consign me you are a papa i don't care you are educated or not i don't care you have a lot of money mm -hmm. it doesn't bother me but like what bothers me is you trying to tell other people what to do like makachuku like who are you <laughs> like what are you feeling like some Genevieve Naji, Naomi Campbell, Michelle Obama, who, even though these people are mentioned, they can't sit down and dictate. They can't do what you're doing. This nonsense you're doing, you'll never see them doing. Woman of dignity, indeed. See, I am done with this video. Bring another video and I'll be here to cancel it. I'll, you see, until you stop that, your nonsense. Eh? If you want us to drag each other <laughs> right at the throat, at the throat, I will what to do what to say like who are you you say a good mother a good mother must protect her child must protect her child a good mother that is why people form good mother and your kids are out there embarrassing you i mean if you are this great like this is why our country is struggling because you know why when the police and i think the nigerian police are actually working very hard recently a kidnapper was arrested was apprehended in abuja and because this guy comes from a particular region in nigeria i could see nigerians at the comment section from that particular region defending a criminal defending a kidnapper saying it's because he's from that side that is why the police arrested him like what do you guys want ah god i beg goes uh, you defending a criminal will make you patriotic nigerian <laughs> you guys will be fine hmm? madam change your ninja or is any video you do about ghana except it's positive if it's a positive one i'll collaborate with you and i'm here for that and if it's a negative one i'll come for you just like i'll, I'll, I'll cancel it for you because you are lying because why you are lying you lie too much and you are fake you want your audience to believe you're intelligent intelligent women do not they do not you, what you have there is not intelligence it is low self-esteem and it is so wrong of you 
so you change your style of content a little bit you don't i will ask you to take your content back to the community tab and be throwing shades there because my leave nigerian youtubers alone okay they do whatever they want if i've given everybody the permission to do whatever they want okay you know the part of nigeria I come from now witchcraft full and oh, like you don't know if my grandmother is actually the leader of the head of witchcraft you know now <laughs> so in case you want to boju me make it a think camo because our bayi oh monkota jail because mole fuloru ole mo i hope you understand get a yoruba friend to interpret that for you i will see you in another one bye